Attention, please. The show starts in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, go. We are the unpassive global twins. Can you see the resemblance? In the face of doubt, we stand tall and steady. We won't crumble, we won't break the part. No, no, Hey, 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 Magic Unicorn of Unpassive. It's Friday, the 5th of January. Hey, don't forget to subscribe and ring that bell so you get every notification when a new video comes out. Anyway, here's Chris and Marty. Don't forget to give them a thumbs up. They like it. Make a nice comment and we'll show it to everybody. <laughs> yes, we will. See you in inside. <laughs> hello, 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 everyone. Uh, that one video had to be cut because it's for a short video. The boom? You cut off the boom after 10 seconds. Well, How you got the countdown, and then he goes, here it is, boom. It didn't play. I love that part. That was my favorite part. You didn't see me in the waiting room. Well, nah. I played it to the end. It didn't go boom. It's still all right, though. It's okay. It did go boom. <laughs> okay, keep talking. Hold on, everybody. Hold on. There You're welcome. You, go. you were looking down at the phone, <laughs> I was... as usual. Anyway, the other one, the other one won't play because it's for a short. It's made from a phone, so I have to uh... use a different angle. Anyway, hello everybody. Here we are, Friday, the fifth of January. Uh, tick tock, tick tock, baby. <laughs> we're on our way. Um, a lot of things going on. You know, I. I know people get a little uh, frustrated with certain things, but I want to tell you, any issue that you might have or on whatever device you have, all that's being done, but I want to explain something so you understand how, how a lot of that type of work is done. Uh, let's say there's a percentage of people that have missing a microphone, and there's a percentage that might have whatever, okay? Now. Nobody wants to go, oh, it's your fault, it's your fault. Nobody's saying that. What I'm saying is, if they find an issue, which which they find, because it's big, it's global, and we, we're growing every second, uh, they don't go in and say, okay, I'm going to fix Marty's account. Okay, I'm done. I'm going to go fix Chris's account. Okay, I'm done, because it would take a million years, right? A million, two million years. What they do is they find the issues, they get them all, and they figure out what they're going to do, and we know, if we don't know, I want to explain, there is a new version coming out. As said, the end of last month, probably in 30 days, there'll be a new version. So what they'll do is when the new version comes out, all of those little spicy things that were adjusted for will come out with it. Now, obviously, they're working on some of the stuff as we go because they always do, okay? Uh, another thing, like I said, I, I, this is only a suggestion. You don't have to do it. I never have an issue. None. 
Now, some of the issues that I do have when I go to attendee, they are what they are. Not everybody's showing up. When you make a recording, it doesn't show everybody on the screen. When you do a video and you shut it off, it comes back on. Some of people's mute mutes on. Got it. That's all done. They're going to work on it. That, that's, that's not a big issue. But I want to tell you something that I did have, and I thought I wasn't sure what it was. And that's when I called my cable company and said, can you tell me, am I getting what? Am I getting the, the, the reading that I should be? And like I said, they came. They even had a guy go up on the pole, and he said, well, you have a filter up there from something. You don't need it. I have a new router. It's, it's the new router that Xfinity came out with. He said, your problem is you're getting 100 in the pole. From the pole to your house, you're getting 60. And from your outside of your house to inside your house, you get like 40. So I wasn't getting what I thought I was getting. Now I've got all the kids on devices, you know, young kids. My grandson's playing PlayStation 5. So my, my, my feed to my computer is really limited. So that has nothing to do with unpassing, nothing. When the guy fixed it, boom, I have nothing. The screen are crisp. I'm not, I'm not looping, nothing. Now, once in a while, you'll see a couple of people that loop. Now, that might be an issue with their, their computer company. Now, I've also had people tell me, I don't know. No, no way. I got the strongest router you can get. I got this. I got that. If there's a problem with the connection, I don't care how strong your router is, it won't work efficiently. It, it won't. And I, I'm, I have proof of that because it happened to me. So look into that. Make sure that's okay. You're paying a lot of money for um, internet and stuff like that. So make sure you're getting what you're paying for. That's all I'm saying. Because they are working on it. Uh, as you know, uh, payments are still going through. If you're having a issue of paying, Try it again, but I tell you what, it, it, it was cranking. And like I said, they look like, and they get the view from inside that things were slamming through, which is good. That means we move on to the next step. And the next step is a big deal. And I said, don't wait a week. Don't wait a month. Don't wait a half a year. Now, get in now. Now, I'm not telling people that haven't purchased O-Connect to purchase it. I'm not going to do that anymore. You don't want to purchase it, don't. Don't purchase it. It's okay. You don't have to. But if you want to get in the game, and when they start to give out these uh, people in the holding tank, you have to be in to win. And you have to you have to start your engine. How do you do that? Listen, this is a, this is a business, a product business. Product sells, you get a commission. Now, like any product, even Walmart and all them, they put the products on their shelf, right? They they have all, all these products. They get them for a lower price and they sell them for a higher one. There's their profit. We we Whatever you own and somebody comes in and purchases it, you get a commission. I'm going to own everything on Passive Heads. Why? Because I want all my shelves full. And, and I want you to think about mindset. We talk about mindset. There's different types of mindset. There's a broke mindset, which is how much does it cost? They're worried constantly what the cost is. Listen, broke is temporary, but how much it costs is, is not the same as how much can I make. Same thing, same item. I look at it and say, wonder how much I can make. When people hear, I'll give you another example. We're going to lower the cost. There's a percentage of people go, yes, oh, yes, not me. Because if they lower the cost, we're going to make less commission. I mean, you got to think about what you're saying and how you look at things. You are in a business. You are in a business that is the potential of being a multi-million dollar business. Multi-million dollar. Everybody said, I'd love to have McDonald's. Not me. I would rather be an unpassive and have a position in unpassive than own a McDonald's. Then five McDonald's. I tell you right now, because I can see the potential. I'm looking ahead. I'm looking at what they've done. And then everybody says, yeah, but you know more. No, I don't. No, I don't. I'm looking at where we've been, even a year. Don't even go back three years. Go back one year. Look at the video that they did. 
of what we've done. And why is all that being done? Oh, because they just like throwing money away? It doesn't make sense. Why, why is our name on a train station that has a million passengers a day? Oh, because they just like people saying the name out loud. No, they're building a business. And people talk about when are we going to start getting traffic? A year ago. We're getting traffic every day. When are we going to start getting targeted traffic? A year ago. When's it going to increase? It's going to increase as we go. But I'm, I don't understand why people say, when is the traffic going to start? It started a long time ago. There's people joining on Passive every day from all around the world. Now, you may not be seeing it yet or seeing the results of it. Why? We got to get to the issue of payments going back and forth, okay? And then we go to door number two and say, okay, now we're going to we're gonna divvy up the people that are in this holding tank. And he wants to give them the people that are serious about being in the business of unpassing. Why would I give a potential customer to Freddie the freeloader who doesn't want to do the business is not going to purchase it and the guy just sits there on his own. That's it. it just doesn't make sense. So if you're coming in to be a business and you want it to be big, here's the cool thing. If you want it to be huge, it will be. It'll be as big as you want it to be. But if you if you're thinking minimum, it could be minimum. You can't, you're not gonna, it's not gonna get huge without you have to have that mindset to say. I want it and I want it. And, and let's ask said it again. Everybody has a unique gift. No doubt about it. Some people have the gift of writing. Some people have the gift of creating. Some people have the gift of communication. Some people are storytellers. Some are uh, more analyzing, more uh, sharing and showing stuff in detail. Everybody's different. Some people are musically inclined. I can't turn on a radio. Some people can build anything. They look at a stack of sticks and see a building. I look at a stack of sticks and I think, dang, I got to clean that up, right? It's just how you look at it and who you are in your life. But if you come in on passive and you have a dream or you have a passion, you can take that passion. I'm going to say it again. You can take any passion you have and turn it around into financial freedom with unpassive. And I know people are going, to, I don't understand what, what you're, why, how you could say that. Take a passion, for example, you love teaching English. Okay. Now you're limited because you're in the United States, let's say, or wherever where they speak English. But there's people around the world that love to learn English a little better. You are in the world. You're in a global company, global, over 200 company, countries. You set up a club, Learning English 101. People are coming in to look at clubs. Oh, look, I can go to learn English. You can monetize that. Not now, but I'm saying as we go. And you set up a class and you have videos. Let's say you make pre, pre-done videos, 10 of them, 20 of them. And as they go through the course, you charge them for the video and they watch it. That's, that's one thing. That's one. I'm looking at many things. You know me, you know for me and Chris right now, we I've got into, I started off in keto, then I went into the carnivore diet. It changed my life. I'm not a doctor. I'm not telling you to do anything. I'm not telling you it's going to make a miracle happen. It was a miracle to me. And some of the people I've talked to have changed their life. So when I express, when I have a, a group that talks about carnivore diet, yes. Why? It's my. It's one of my passions. Another passion is I love talking to people and seeing people grow. Like we've been doing shine the light on uh, founders. We're going to start that up again. The point is a year from now, it's going to be even more fun. Why? 
you bring that person back and you compare the two, where they've been, what happens in Unpassing in six months, seven months, and where they are then. But I'm telling you, think about what you want, when you want it, and use this vehicle, this platform called on passive and ride it for everything you can. The other night we were fortunate enough and Mr. McFarland gave his personal what he wanted. And it was it was actually very powerful, one of the most powerful things I've heard. What he wants. And it's not about money. He's made money. He, he it, money is not any kind of drive for him none he's done it he's done well he's you know it, it's just it's more about family and taking care and doing for others and once i get established this is for me personally i get out of debt completely i make sure the kids have everything that they want i have to spoil my wife because She's done miraculous for me. That's me. But then down the road, I want to start a podcast. I love talking to people. Chris is going to do it with me. And we're going to start a podcast together. And at one, one point, I'd like to have an office where I can not be in unpassive in my living room. Because there's some days the kids don't want to be in unpassive. But anyway, so those are little goals that I have. But they mean a lot to me. Are they going to happen? Yes, unless I die. Already got my mind made up. I know this vehicle I'm passing will give me whatever I want. That's what I want right now. I want to get up. I want to pay my debt. I need to move into a larger house because my grandchildren are getting larger, and I might be adding to that family, and that's okay. I just want the room, and then I want them to have an education. I want them to be involved in things. Uh, I talked to my my granddaughter the other day, and she said to me, this is Alexis, I think it'd be good if we could go to like a place where old people are and visit with them and talk to them because some of them are lonely. I'm like, wow, yeah, it's the best thing I heard. Those are the type of things. What can we do to help others? And if you have the freedom financially where you're not worried about money, you can focus more on other things. If your time spent 10%, 20%, 30%, how am I going to pay this? When am I going to be able to pay that? When it, that's, to me, a big problem. And if I'm passive, takes that away. Now, it's not a magic wand. You have to make an effort. You can't just lay back on the couch and go, I'm passive, make me a millionaire. I mean, other companies tell you that, but it doesn't happen. Get out there, find out who you are. Find out who you are. Robert Williamson, you're right. Chris, wake up. How much? Make- <laughs> there, there's something about, there's something out there, and I, and I can see it in people's face when it finally hits them. Oh, I know, I know who I am. I know what I want. It takes time. I get it. But start thinking about where we can go and what we can do. It'll be fantastic. Chris and Marty. Hello, dear Myra. I should be putting you to sleep by now, Myra. Calm down. No, no, that's Narelle you put to sleep. Myra is my Spanish-speaking oh, buddy who uh, thinks I don't like her. <laughs> yeah, not, uh, Narelle, you should be asleep by now. Como estas? Anyway, um, Como estas? I'm going to, um, I just want to emphasize, there's a lot of stuff in the burner coming. We know that. Uh, we had a video the other day about Odesk. Yes. We know that O-Verify is right around the corner. We know that uh, just everything is right there. And I said, don't wait. I tell you what, I do not want somebody phone call, sending me a phone call or a message when they decide they're going to get in in three months and pay for something and go, I don't have any, whoa, 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 wrong guy. In fact, I wouldn't. I don't accept that stuff now. If you call me expecting me to talk you into something, big mistake. I'm not the guy to call. If, you, if you're in and you're doing what you can and you need assistance, I'm a guide. I'll guide you. But we've already started climbing this mountain. If you're not going to even climb, I can't help you. I'm not going to drag somebody. That doesn't make sense. You lend a hand down so they can get up with you. 
You don't lend a hand down and they put their feet down and you drag them down. No, you got to want to it. If you don't want to, don't do it. I hear people saying to other people, oh, I got this person that's threatening to quit. Quit. Another thing I want to bring up. For four and a half years, no, five years, over five years, I'm sorry. If you came in on passive, you paid 97 to be a founder. If you wanted your money back, the NDA says 30 days. But Ash said, now, if they don't want to be here, I'll give it back. But the $97 for a founder position refund is over. You cannot ask for a $97 refund. It's not there. It hasn't been incorporated into your bank or into your holding wallet in OES. If you don't want to use it, don't. But you cannot ask for a founder. I heard people talking about it yesterday. The, the founder payoff is gone. If five years didn't do it, well, too bad. But there is none. It was already paid back. It was put into your wallet so you could use it to get going. Somebody goes six, nine times around the lap, and the 10th lap is the finish, and they say, I don't want to finish the race. Okay, don't. Well, I want all that. I want my money. What money? Come on, that's crazy. You, you, you're not getting it back. It's not there. So when somebody's telling other people, oh, you can re request. No, don't request. You're not getting it. It's not there. It was for 30 days originally, and Mr. Mufar paid back for five years. More than five years. So please, if you don't want to purchase a product, don't. Because there's going to be millions that like it and want to do it. So nobody's talking you into it. Because if you can't see it, I don't think you're going to. But I wish you did. I, 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 would, I wouldn't want anybody not to go. We've gone this far. Are you kidding? We're on the one yard line ready to win this Super Bowl. And you're going to... And I don't think I'm going to finish. Fine. Are you kidding? <laughs> we ran down the field all the time. And all the blocking and all the, 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 the weightlifting and blocking and everything is done for us. We're just walking down the field. That's all we had to do. So anyway, yeah, if you want to do that or you want to be, okay, fine. And nobody's blaming anybody. If you see something, listen, don't confuse like, oh, it's your fault. Nobody's fault of anything. But you got to find a way. There's, I've gone into the back office and start up something, and my first, my first thought is, I'm not sure where that button's is, and start calling somebody. I don't know what this. I don't know. Find out. It's there. Now, if it's not, yeah, it's a pro the company will fix it. And I'm not, I'm not telling everybody, oh, you don't see this, it's your problem. No, I'm not saying that. But at least try. Look around. If you don't see it, or wait a couple of minutes where it pops on, okay. If it doesn't, we know. We know it. Chris, sir, will we get traffic this month? Uh, will you will you get traffic this month? I don't know. But the traffic is coming in right now, all the time. All the time. All the time. Anticipating great days. Yeah, absolutely. Great days are coming. Great days are here. It depends on how you look at things. Anyway, yeah, so be ready. Uh, Mr. Mufar, he must have said this three or four times. Don't wait. This is not about deciding. You should have decided. You're in, you're not in. And for people that watch this from the outside, and they think we're trying to talk people into something. No. Don't do it if you don't want to do it. Seriously. I'm, I, I can't imagine anybody trying to talk you into something. Don't do it. Do not buy O Connect and purchase it if you don't like O Connect and you don't want to do it. That's crazy. I'm in it. There's thousands, or hundreds of thousands of people that love it. It looks like there's over a million, million and a half, or two million that came in and they love it. So I'm I'm happy as a lark. But never ever do I try to change anybody or talk them into it. That's crazy. This is too good to do that. And, and you're not gonna be able to do it. That, that that conversation never ends. You sell on, you have to sell somebody on something today. You're going to have to sell them again tomorrow. And then six months, sell them again. Next month, sell them again. How come I'm not a millionaire? 
I don't know, because you're laying on a couch with sunglasses <laughs> on and you haven't moved in six months. I, maybe that's it. I'm not sure. But anyway, no, we're, we're in it together. Listen, I, like I said, we'll have a, we'll make it, we'll set up a club or something where any ideas to enhance your business, we can have ideas with each other and put them in there. I have no problem of, of giving ideas. I think it's fun. But if you, if you want to, um, a pat, you know, a push all the time. I, I, I'm not that guy. None of us should be that guy or a woman. But if you're in and you, you want to march ahead, yeah, man, that's I love that. Of course. Anyway, I'm going to turn it over to Chris. Chris, take your time. I'll check <laughs> out the chat and um, check your you know, uh, email. Bill just emailed you back. I think he just texted me. Um. Wow. Wow. Lots. Marty had lots to say today. Uh, Chris frozen. Yeah, he's frozen. So, to me, what? Marty, what'd you say? You were frozen for about thirty seconds. You were frozen oh, for about okay. thirty seconds. All right. Well, happy birthday, yeah. all those so people. Go ahead. I was frozen on. <laughs> happy birthday! A lot of birthdays today, uh, boy. I, I want to say two things. I woke up to the coolest message in the world today. Um, new version, Marty also speaks. Um, check your email from from Bill. Uh, I want to I want to talk about this because it was very exciting for me. A lady, Donku Florence. Not wrong, lady. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> Man, you guys, why I'm looking at my phone all the time. <laughs> Where does she go now? Anyway, I wake up to this lady. There she is, Lydia. And the other day she said, Chris, you'll never guess who signed up for on Passive from PNG. Okay, I'm waiting. I'm waiting. I, I reply, I'm waiting. Well, who is it? And she says, and I will show this on my Facebook after this is over. I thought it was cool. And I, I'm going to I'm gonna call it whatever it takes. There's a gentleman in Papua New Guinea who has a family, he's a teacher, and here she has him signing his NDA, a live video, with his feet. He has no arms, no hands, nothing, and she wanted to show, look, look whatever it takes, this guy's show, signing his NDA with his feet, and I thought myself, wow, and I'm, people are complaining and they got two arms. <laughs> I mean, I loved it. Lydia, I thank you for sharing. I asked her if I could talk about it. She said, yeah. She sent me pictures of his family. Just cool. That's that's the kind of stuff I love to hear about. Uh, this guy's a teacher in Papua New Guinea also, married with kids. And it's an also, it's just cool to see something like that. And I want to touch on, go right back to like, not the negative. We got some messages yesterday that were pretty, pretty strong about what Marty was talking about, about, um, you guys don't know, and, and I'm, I'm going to tell you something right now. You are absolutely correct. Because we are on the panel, we don't see what's in the attendance uh, of what you see or what you don't see. But we have a lot of people that text me on a daily basis when we're on these, letting me know, Chris, we don't see this. And that helps us. Okay. Now, sometimes we give a little bit of advice. Uh, you heard Red the other day talking about what Ash said about you got to check into your own system. And, and I said, listen, open your screen. You'll see your button. Now, that's just stuff that we learned to tell people. Uh, but some people, like I said, the button was there, and they got really upset about that, that we were telling them. We're not telling anyone what to do. We're trying to help you because we don't see what you're seeing. We rely on you to tell us, and that's what happened. People started texting me, leaving me voice messages, saying, listen, we're doing this. It's not there. <laughs> and I get your frustration. I really do. And because we are on the panel, we don't see a lot of, uh, a lot of the stuff that's going on, but without your help, now we do. So I want to thank you for that. I ask you not to be discouraged. And like I said, there was some, I get some pretty mean messages once in a while, which I take with a grain of salt because I understand if someone gets frustrated or, or maybe they're in just a position where they think they're going to be left behind. I said it again the other day. 
listen, no one's going to be left behind. We're doing whatever it takes to help every single individual out. And I absolutely love that. But to know that, uh, Lydia says, Chris, I'm crying here. Well, listen, to know there's someone out there, and I want to say his name properly. You hear my phone going crazy. That's what it does all day. His proper name of this gentleman, and I want to say it right, uh, Y-A-L-O-M-A, Yaloma. If I said that right or wrong, I apologize. Um, that's that's inspiration to me because I have people that call me every day that's got arms, legs, eyes, and they're going at me. Now, this this lady wants to show this guy showing he signed his NDA with his feet because he's got no arms and legs. Now, that gave me a lot of inspiration today to think, what do I have to complain about? And I'm going to say this again. I've said it before. We're complaining about things when we have everything. And some people have absolutely nothing, and they're not complaining. They are just very grateful that this is part of their lives now. And I know someone's going to get mad at me for saying that, but I don't want you to get mad at me. We do whatever it takes to help everyone out. There's a lot of things that are going on. It's not one individual, like Marty was talking about earlier, that we have to deal with. It's many. And we try to help people. Uh, I got a call today, early this morning, two two calls. Or one text, one call. Chris, my profile, there's nothing in it. Wow. I know. We've talked about that. That's because we all have that right now. And I believe it's going to be something to do with uh, getting the, uh, not the KYC. I can't even think of what I'm saying now. The uh, M. I can't think of the word. Oh, oh, verify. Thank you. I read lips. Uh, that's something with oh, verify. So right now that I know of everyone's profile is empty. They said, should I fill it in again? You can't. They know it. This is what they're doing to get ready for oh, verify. So you can uh, relax on that one. Uh, could you make a tutorial video on how we can use podcast? And I could, I'm sure because we've never done it yet. But I'm sure that'll come out. Everything that you guys want is going to happen. We just have to give it a little time. There's many things that you might see as wrong. And, and like, oh, connect. I, I think it's working great. We got a little video issue where it's not showing certain things to the attendees or when we record it. We understand that. We know about it. Uh, we want everyone to understand that Ash knows about it. They're working on it. But when he said, you know, we are going to. I said his name correctly. Very good. We're going to name or uh, we're going to revamp the whole thing. So these issues you're seeing are probably going to be going bye-bye. All right. But they're working on it in the process. A lot of people get in there and it says it doesn't work. When that when it's not working, that means they are updating it. They are looking at it. They're redoing it. And I had some people the other day, oh, why would he do that? Because that's what he has to do. It's live. Remember this. Every big company, especially in a startup, you had no idea what they were doing. No idea. It was just like me building cars. I can relate on that. None of you knew what it was like to first launch the brand new Mustang a few years back for the new models. It was horrific. You have no idea what it, what, what it takes to start something up, especially globally. I can only talk about cars. But I'm thinking Ash Bafara with all the people, with all the – I mean, one little coding error could mess up a whole bunch of things. And what do they do? They realize it. They save everything. They get in there, they adjust the coding error, and start it up again. That's how it's got to be done. Remember, we're in a startup mode, guys. We're in startup mode. Don't let anyone else tell you different because there's people out there trying to scare you again. Don't be scared. Be brave. <laughs> be courageous because you don't even really need to be that. It's here. It's happening. Uh, I just got a text from a lady, Holland in another country. They're having issues trying to get through with their cards. And I say, be patient. Ash knows about those. Remember, he's turning on and off windows so everything goes smoothly and we don't have, you know, we, no one's going to red flag us. If you notice, that's worked pretty good. So that system he's designed right now to keep this thing going uh, has worked, I think, awesome. Um, we did not uh, do a minute last night. We had a quick little meeting we had to go that turned out to be a little longer. Uh, we got some things done. And that was with me and Marty. We had a lot of things that we wanted to discuss. So we don't always, sometimes we're just not going to show up on the, the trivia show. We apologize to our favorite lady, Manu. That just happens sometimes. So we've got to get things done. I know Marty DeGarmel's 
nose was running like a horse race yesterday, so he, he didn't feel real good. Uh, but I just want to let you all know, right now, if I didn't have an impassive, I would be, I don't think I'd be very happy, to be honest with you. Yeah, I'm retired, things I want to do, but the things that I really want to do are going to happen because of impassive. And that's the way I look at it. And there's someone right now, let's say in Papua New Guinea with no arms, who's very excited that he's going to really be able to take care of his family uh, through Unpassive, and that's going to help. And that's one of the things I want to show you. Anybody can do Unpassive. Now, this gentleman's a teacher. Yep, he doesn't have the, the limbs, uh, but he gets through life, and he, and, he, and he does great with it. But there's a lot of people, especially in America, that, oh, what, what are we going to hire this person for? He's not going to be a factory worker. Can't put things together. Uh, we have people with diseases that can't work. We have people with issues that can't work. But everyone on passive can do it because you can do it from home. And you really don't have to do none. It doesn't matter what your situation is. We've talked about this many a times. All right. It doesn't matter who you are in on passive, what you are, what your situation. Blind, deaf, paralyzed, no limbs, one limb. It doesn't matter. You could do this. Because it was designed to do it, make or get it done for every, anyone that wants it. And we have a lot of people, believe it or not, that are signing up as affiliates every single day. Uh, every single day. As you can see, that guy that just signed his NDA, <laughs> he's an affiliate. And I think that's pretty cool. So, but the people that want to complain, listen, it's not always fun. That's the, the non fun part when someone comes up and, and, and yelling at you. They're yelling at you, they're yelling at you, and then they're apologizing, and that's okay. But remember, before you call me, you'll send me a message in anger. I want you to really think about what we're saying today, and we're not here to harm or hurt. We're here to help. Sometimes it takes – I missed a guy the other day, uh, Mr. Wilton. I apologize. He sent me a text. I read it. I got 45 different other texts, and I forgot about them. Uh, uh, Julie went, came in there and helped the guy out. I called him to apologize, texted him to apologize that I got busy. Very nice. Chris understood, uh, getting it done. And, and a lot of it has to do, a lot of people are saying where they're signing people up, but they're not seeing them. And though there's a few, just a few of those I've gotten. And we're trying to figure that one out. Why? Um, and I'm not sure why, to be honest with you, we have to go through your back office to see if they did everything. Uh, the right way or wrong way, I don't know. I don't think even Marty, we, we discussed this. we got to figure that one out. There could be a couple different reasons, but don't panic. Don't panic. Everything can be fixed. Everything can be adjusted. And you're going to find out at the end of this month all the, the people that were saying this don't work or that don't work. And a lot of it is, I don't care what you say, a lot of it is our own personal our devices or our cables. I've had that issue where one little cable outside my house had water dripping on it, and it caused everything to go wacky. The guy had to come out, cut it. It was a five-second fix, put it together. So myself, what I have to do is I want to build like a shelter for that because whether it rains or whatever, it somehow gets water in there. But these are older cables. These are cables that have been there for Remember that. These cables have been there for years. So they're brittle. They're, when, they, when they start bedding, they have little openings. That's where the condensation gets in there. So I'm telling you, check it out. I just showed a guy earlier Warnicky that you know he had a, he had too much going into his system they had to use a splitter and now everything works great for him so but just check every possible way out red is coming on at 11 o'clock he texts me uh <laughs> lots, lots of messages today on paying guys take your time when paying if you can't get in today don't don't do it every five seconds all you're going to do is get frustrated, all right? You can talk to uh, our good sister, southern sister Caroline, who was saying, I can't get in, and she now has all her accounts paid for. She's happy as a lark. Absolutely <laughs> I love that. We love when people are happy, okay? We have a lot of people that are happy. Don't get me wrong. But if someone's – I don't like when anyone's frustrated or getting upset uh, because a lot – listen, you – Worry does nothing. Worry is a double-edged sword. There's no reason to worry. Just know this, that you're in this. If you're a founder, you are the most safest person in the world as far as I'm concerned. And when this explodes very soon, very soon, when it goes pop, 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 
bam, boom, there's another, there's another one. You're going to forget about all that stuff. But don't worry. Don't worry. What's that? Be happy. I can't sing this morning. But I love every one of you. We're praying for you. Um, I've got someone calling me right now. And he's frozen. That is a founder uh, from where I used to work. So I got to give him a call back. He's again, see, real nice, real nice. Be nice to people. All right, Marty, back to you. I'm just rambling now. All right, no problem. A um, couple things you, Chris reminded me of. The beauty of Unpassive is it's colorblind. If you have any type of disability, physical or some some disabilities are you can't see, uh, the color of your skin, your religious, what what um, country you're from, it doesn't care. If you're in and you want to win, you can win. That's beauty of this. I love it. Hearing about that 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 gentleman that had to sign with his feet. Listen, what other place could you win? Look, there's people for a fact. I, I mean, let's think about this. Somebody maybe has epilepsy. Now, they have to mark that on their thing that the, this is a condition they have. Now, can a, can a company legitimately say we're not hiring you because you have that? No, they get in trouble. But you, you know without a doubt that people are either hired or not hired because of all the things that I mentioned. Maybe the color of your skin. Maybe because you have epilepsy, maybe because you're hearing impaired, whatever it might be. On passive, is colorblind. It does not care who you are. It does not care what your religion is. It doesn't care if you're tall, skinny, short, fat. It doesn't care. That's the beauty of on passive. And I love that about on passive. It's an equal opportunity wealth distributor okay <laughs> i think i said that how i wanted to so everybody has the option and i and i i mean this if you know me at all i mean this as much as a, i per, per, uh, possibly can i love the idea that people i've met and people i've talked to in the last five years are going to be successful and i'm going to be able to watch it happen that is awesome to me <clears throat> and i can't wait Yes, we meet at night and we do trivia and all that, but it's going to mean so much more to meet some of you in person and actually share, share stories and have have a good time because we built such a relationship and I'll never forget it as long as I live. It's the best that ever happened to me because I thought, like I said, when I had wound up losing my job and things happened years ago, I thought I was maxed out, right? 42. I hit my peak, it's all down here from, from here. Not knowing that when I was 59, I would run into passive. And that that will help me change things for my life and my family and my friends. How? I'm gonna be able to get more for what Dawn needs. She does a lot of work by herself. My grandchildren, give them maybe <clears throat> a better education. Teach them how to love people overseas and not judge a book by its cover. Because you know, on passive, drain the ocean. On passive, knock down all the walls. We, we meet each other face to face in o, o Connect every day. And when you talk to people and you hear what they have to say, it's the same. Different accent, different look, but people in general are good. Yeah, there's some bad things. We look, we're a sinning group, okay? It happens. Nobody's perfect. But everybody in general has a good thing about them. And that said something a long time ago to me, and, I, and I'll never forget it. He looks at the good in people, even if it's one thing. Why, why focus on bad, you know? Because a lot of times, if you can look at somebody's good and edify their, their goodness, whatever it might be, it actually will start to swallow the bad, the negative, it really can. Good can overcome bad. I, that's a guarantee. But you got to believe it. 
some people dwell in the in the world of negativity because they're almost comfortable there, which is sad. Because if they're if they're positive and they're outgoing and they want things right, you you're taking a chance. You're putting your head out there. You're you got your neck exposed, but that's okay. Whatever you can do, fall down. Trip and fall. It's okay. As long as you get up, just get up. If you fall on your back, at least you're looking up. If you can look up, you can get up. Do that. And we're, we're in for a ride of our life. I love all of you. I, I see it every day. Don't put anybody down. Remember, everybody in the world, especially in Unpassive, is, is at a different level of this journey for them personally. It doesn't stop the company in its journey because we're right there. And like I said, he never, ever, neither does the company want to leave anybody behind. But eventually, eventually, you got to get on the train because it's rolling. <clears throat> if you're left behind, it's because you were determined to be left behind. And I hope that doesn't happen. Anyway, love you all. Chris, I'm going to go. And uh, <laughs> thanks, everybody. <laughs> you make a we'll see you later. Is there anything I need to mention? Oh, I believe uh, Robin... The voice is on uh, yes. comfort. Comfort at four o'clock. Uh, I might even join them. I doubt it. I don't want to block out Robin. I'm being mistake. Anyway, uh, I'll see you all. I mean that. And God bless. Bye, everybody.